Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to present you the best way how you can get eSIM when you want to travel to Asia. This is something that I'm personally using so that's why I'm recommending it for you and I hope it will help you on your journey when you travel across Asia. So the first one that I definitely recommend to check out is Maya Mobile. You're gonna have this discount down below in the description too. And all you have to do is click here on the travel eSIM and right here Asia. And I'm going to guide you through the whole process how this works. Here, you can have option between multiple uh, date plans. So 5 days, 10 days, 15 days, 30 days. So let's say you're going to be 15 days here. And you're going to have Asia plus ASM. And here it's for 19 USD. It depends how many days and how much gigabyte of data you actually want. Now let's say that I want to go for 10 gigabytes. When you would click here activate now. Here, you're going to get also 10% discount from me. So that's like a really good bonus for you. When you would come here, also you can click including 12 countries and let's check what kind of countries we're going to have covered in Asia package. And you see right here, Australia, China, Malaysia, Taiwan, Thailand, Vietnam, Philippines, Indonesia. All of that you're going to have covered right here in Asia eSIM coverage. So that's really good. Now what I would like about my mobile also is that you can use the data as you can use the data as hotspot too. Now, there are two important things. The first thing is that check if your phone is eSIM compatible. When you would click here, help and eSIM compatible phones and try to find your phone here. And the second thing, what you can do, you can click your coverage. And when you're going to click coverage here, you're going to have like what is actually covered with Maya Mobile. This is directly connected to those local networks. And you see that when you want to travel to Finland and you want to be in Bangkok, you know that you're going to be covered. But let's say that you're going to be somewhere here in Khao Yai National Park. I hope I read it correctly. Or maybe you want to be re here in Davai. You see that it's not covered at all. So I definitely recommend check out the coverage right here to see even Vietnam here. You see that most of the Vietnam is covered. But here are the, like, the ways they are not. So that's important thing to check out when you want to travel if you're going to actually get the data there. The second way how I recommend is choosing Aerolo. Aerolo you're going to have also linked down below in the description with the discount that you're going to have to use a code. Here when you would click here regional eSIM you're going to have Asia. Okay. And here look at this. We have 1 GB, 3 GB, 5 GB of data, 10 GB. So let's say that we want to go 10 GB here and check this out. 10 GB here on Asia Plus for 30 days is going to be 1890. Here, 30 days, 10 gigabyte is going to be um, even more money. So you see right here and countries are similar. So that's about it. You can check it out by yourself and compare these two. But these are the two that I definitely recommend. And the whole process of activation. So with the um, my mobile, you're going to get a QR code. The same process applies with Aerolo. But with the Aerolo, you can have options to use also app. The activation is simple. I made even guides for you. So you're going to have links down below in the description for it. And that's pretty much it. So thank you very much guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day and goodbye.